As the secretary treasurer of your lodge, you and the lodge president are responsible for setting up local lodge meetings. When scheduling a meeting, keep in mind that members should receive their meeting notice in the mail 15 days prior to the meeting date. Whether you are sending out your own meeting cards or having National Division print them for you, you must cover several key options when filling out the notice. Make sure your notice has the date, time, and location of where the meeting will be held. You must specify if it is a regular meeting or a special meeting. A regular meeting is scheduled to conduct normal lodge business at hand, whereas a special meeting is called to discuss a specific subject or to hold lodge elections. You will find the correct way to conduct a local lodge meeting in your secretary treasurer's manual in the BMWED ritual section. There you will see the rules of order, opening ceremony, order of business, and the closing ceremony. When conducting a lodge meeting, you are responsible for keeping accurate minutes. If a major purchase is being decided, it is extremely important for you to document who made the motion of the purchase, who seconded the motion, and if the majority in attendance were in favor of the motion. Never throw your minutes of meeting away, as you never know when you may need to reference them regarding a decision or a purchase made in the past. Also, if a compliance audit is ever conducted on your lodge by the U.S. Department of Labor, they will require you to provide your minutes of meeting book. A minute book can be ordered from National Division free of charge on the BMWED website, submitting an order of supplies form, or by calling National Division directly.